Hello everyone, Annie Valdinelli here. And if you're watching this video, you probably book a call with my team. So congratulations. So if you don't know who I am, my name is Annie Valdinelli. I'm the owner of e-commerce hub, an e-commerce agency based in Miami, Florida. I also own a fulfillment center here in Miami where we process our own orders for our brands on Shopify and on Etsy. I also own a seven figure Etsy brand that I scale literally from scratch till seven figures in a 24 month period. I have been in the e-commerce space for more than seven years now, and I can tell you e-commerce is something that's gonna change your life forever. I have seen a lot of success in the industry, and I went literally from zero to 100. I came from Venezuela in 2017. I was driving Uber and doing ballet parking. So I was basically going to my ballet parking job at the Ritz Carton on Key Biscayne from 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. And then after that, I would go and do Uber. So with the ballet parking um, check, I was, I, I was able to pay for my bills. And then I was doing Uber from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m., sometimes even 9 p.m just to get some money to pay for ads. And within my first years of uh, on e-commerce, I did zero sales. I'm not kidding. I did zero sales within my first year on e-commerce in 2017. It was a whole different game. It's not like now that you have all this information and all these tools to make it happen. Back then, it was a struggle. I was, I was literally just failing over and over and over. And I can tell you that's probably the best thing that can happen to me because it allowed me to learn everything about the e-commerce space. Everything from managing ads, creating Shopify stores, working with influencers, customer service, order fulfillment. I literally learned everything during those years. And now that I have sustainable brands, now that I can say that I live out of e-commerce is the perfect time for me to share that information, to share that knowledge with people so you can basically do the same thing. The formula that I use for my Exit brands is a formula that you can easily duplicate on your own brands. Not, I'm not talking about your own brand. I'm talking about your own brands. You can have multiple brands with the same formula and you're gonna get success. I'm not just talking, guys. I'll actually go into one of my stores and I'll show you my my real numbers. I'll show you my numbers on a daily basis. I'll show you how much money I make today, how much money I did yesterday, last week, last month, last year. I'll show you everything right now on this video so you know exactly who you're learning from, who you're going to sit down in a call with, and who you need to listen to because it's really difficult to give our valuable time. I'm talking about your time, my time, to someone that is not doing what they preach. You know, if the person that is trying to teach me their formula is not making money out of what they teaching, then there's no point on us listening to these people. So it's really important for me to show you my numbers so you know it's worth it for you to give me your time in these calls and see if we can help you to get the same results. So let me go into my results real quick and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so now let's jump into my computer. Let me show you some numbers. So from one of my Exit brands and you are gonna be able to see how much money you can actually make with this e-commerce platform. So let's get into last year. So I wanna go, I wanna go last year first because I wanna show you the whole thing, okay? I wanna make sure that you understand how everything works from A to C. So let me go back to last year. We probably make so much money that they not even able to <laughs> they're not even able to, to come up with the with <laughs> with the dashboard. So I'm just kidding. Okay, so last year, January to December twenty twenty two, we make can you can you read this number here? This revenue right here? Yeah, that's one million dollar seven hundred and ninety one thousand nine hundred and twenty six. That's a four point five percent conversion rate. If you are into e commerce, you know that this conversion rate is a high conversion rate. Is it means that we have a sustainable business. It means that we have people coming to us on a monthly basis, buy from us. It means that we have a good returning conversion rate. It means that we actually convert out of the traffic 
that we bring into our Etsy shop. 51,000 orders and not a single order out of these 51,000 is currently open. And that's something that you cannot, you know, you cannot afford on, on platforms like Exe. You need to have your stuff together. You need to have a system in place. You need to make sure that if you're going to bring 51,000 orders is because you definitely can process all of them and you can provide a good post purchase experience because everyone wants to make these type of numbers, but obviously you don't get these numbers by working yourself. You don't get these numbers by, you know, just drop chipping without any effort. You actually get to these numbers by having a system in place. You need systems and procedures. You need a team. You need a system in place, a structure, a post-purchase experience that is fully automated in order for you to be able to scale without necessarily having to fail because there's so many brands out there that they cannot afford to scale the way that they, they scale sometimes they scale so hard that it's not even sustainable because they cannot provide the service in a good way they don't they are not prepared for the amount of um, orders that they have to deal with so that's something that we take care of from the early stages that way you can have a sustainable business that it doesn't matter how fast you scale, you can always have your business in order. That's the most important thing. So this is last year. Now I want to go over this year so far. So 2023, we're looking at $653,000 in revenue with a 3.7% conversion rate. 17,000 orders so far and more than 400,000 visits into our exit shop. Now I'm going to go a little bit down here and I'm going to show you guys just so we are, you know, fully aware of where this traffic is coming from and an, an idea of how much the profit can be. Because I want to make sure that this is clear. Many people ask me, what is the profit margin? There's no a specific profit margin, and the reason for it is because first we process our own orders, so it means that we literally pay ourselves. I have people on a warehouse working Monday to Friday, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Eastern time, Miami time, processing every order that we get on a daily basis, and I pay them hourly to do that work. I also invest a lot of money into machines that can create this print-on-demand product on a record time so we literally have dtg machines where we any design that we put out there and people buy we can process that design immediately we can ship that order the same day it doesn't matter if it's christmas mother's day valentine's day we always ship on time so i have entire logistic behind my brand and that's why i was able to scale this hard i wasn't rich when i started i didn't have a lot of money when i started either I literally start with nothing. So if I did it, you can do it too. And that's the main reason what we're doing, what we're doing. Because if I can, you know, if I sit down here and tell you, yeah, I did this all day, I did all this brand because I had, you know, six figures on savings and I just invested all into this brand and now I'm making six figures per month. That's, that's ideal. That's beautiful. That's something that I'm now able to do. But back then, it wasn't like that. I started from zero. I literally have help from my girlfriend, which is probably like the MVP on this whole thing. She's probably the the, the, the reason for these numbers because when you see uh, platforms like Exe, we're talking about a platform that is 85% woman. So you really need that feminine touch in order for you to actually scale brands on Exe, whether if it's your mom, your girlfriend, your best friend, whatever. But you always want to make sure that you have a woman on your team that can guide you on what the trend is when it comes to platforms like Exe. It's not something that you, you know, that, that is an obligation, but it's, it really helps. And uh, if you're a woman and you're watching this video, you, you have a huge advantage if you're an e-commerce, if you're an Exe. Because Exe is your platform. Exe is for you, literally. Like 85% of uh, 
the audience on X is women. So you, if you're a woman and you're watching this video, you have a huge advantage. You already know what you girls like. So just go ahead and sell that. Don't try to reinvent the wheel. Actually go for what is already selling and make sure that you have a really good brand in place, that you have a really good order processing once people order from you and that you have a good customer service and you are good to go. So this is this year so far. So as you can see, these are the numbers, but now I wanna break it down in a way that you can see what the day-to-day -day is when it comes to running an XE brand. So let's go into uh, last 30 days. Let's go with last 30 days. Is always the same numbers. It's always 140,000 plus. So we keep a consistency in ourselves and we, you only get to that by having a system in place, by having systems and procedures, by having a good post-purchase experience, by having a good customer service. That's, that, that's what actually matters on platforms like XE. This is not the same as Shopify when you actually own the brand and you need to take care of the entire marketing ecosystem. On places like Exe, they actually gonna bring the traffic for you. They actually gonna put money on your pocket, but they first need to understand what your business is all about. Are you gonna chip your orders on time? Are you gonna respond to your clients on time? Are you gonna have a good customer service, good post-purchase post -purchase, post -purchase experience? <laughs> Are you going to have a good post-purchase experience? Are you going to offer the people that buy from you a good experience for them to come back and purchase more from you? Bexy is basically watching your business and seeing if you are able to be on top of every element that I just, every aspect or every um everything that I just mentioned. And they are going to pay close attention to your business when your first 60 to 90 days so the first three months of your exit business are the most important because that's when you can actually show exit that you're valuable that you are a good seller that you have potential and they are gonna start putting traffic into your exit shop it's not like Shopify where you have to go out there and bring that traffic you can actually get that traffic for free if you do the right thing on exit so let me show you here what I'm talking about these last 30 days we did 143,000 3.7 conversion rate more than 3,000 orders and we've been more than 100,000 people to our XE shop. Well, how I did that? We did that with XE bringing 70% of that traffic. So that's exactly what I mean. We have a good system in place. We chip our orders on time. We always have uh, customers coming back to our shop. So XE already know that we are a sustainable brand. They already know that we are what they are looking for on their platform. Sustainable businesses. Businesses that can create a good um, post purchase experience for their audience for the audience that they pay for to get into their platform because because just like amazon xe spend a lot of money into bringing people to their platform they've spent a lot of money on marketing and i talk about this within the program we have a lot of people now coming into xe the, the difference between the people selling on xe and the people buying on xe is extremely it's, it's, it's super, you know, it's, it's, it's two different words. We're talking about just a small percentage of people selling on the platform and a hundred times that number on people buying on the platform. So the difference between the people selling on the platform and people buying on the platform on XE is super, super huge. So there's so much demand for whatever you sell on that platform that is the right time to get into it. As long as you follow the rules, as long as you have a business in place, as long as you have a good logistic, you're gonna get rewarded. And what I mean by that is, X is going to bring 70% of your traffic while you bring 30% of your traffic. And I don't know if you, you know, if you can do the math, that's a lot of profit because you're not, you're not, you're not spending money on marketing. You literally spending money on your order, which in my case is $4.65. So for example, for those asking about my exact profit margins, let me break it down. Let me break it down for you this way. Exe is bringing 70% of my traffic, right? So the only thing that I actually had to pay is for my order. And my orders, you know, I'm processing, since I'm processing my order on my own warehouse, I'm paying $4.65. And how I can break down that uh, $4.65 product cost is by having three 
point sixty five cents shipping cost. So that's my shipping. That's what it cost me to put my product on my customer door. And I, on top of that, I have a dollar as an exact dollar that it cost me to create the order. Since I already have the machines and I already have the people creating the, the product for me, that product, it cost me a dollar just because I made it myself. And when I put everything together besides the blankets, the blanks and the printing, it comes into a dollar. Sometimes it can go to a dollar and 50, depending on the sizing, but my, my, overall uh, product cost is always less than five dollars so with less than five dollars product cost and shipping cost meaning that that's exactly what i pay for my product to be on my customer door i pay a five dollars or less every time that someone buy from me within the u.s and what my profit is is i sell my products for either 15 bucks, so $14.99 or $19.99 or $24.99. Depending on the product, I will either go for $14.99, $19.99 or $24.99. I can also put my products at $12.99 on sale and I will still make more than 50% profit margins. So profit margins are whatever you want them to be. There's so many people that ask me, what are the profit margins that you get from Exi? That's up to you. If you want to get 60% profit margins, if you want to have 70% profit margins, if you want to have 30% profit margins, it's totally up to you. It's the same work. Whether if you make 30% profit margins or you do 65% profit margins, it's literally the same work. The delivery is the same. The order processing is the same. It's, a, it's only up to you to find the right product to get the right profit margins, whether if it's physical products, digital products, or print on demand, you can have more than 50% profit margins if you focus on product research before you get your inventory up and running. Now let's go back into my dashboard and now I'm gonna show you the last seven days of my, of my Exit shop. So last seven days we did over 30, well, 27,000, 28,000, but look, this is from March, this is from May 1st to May 7. It's counting May 7, even though today's May 6, okay? So I'll just go and do the custom because I really want to give you the exact numbers, guys. I don't want to miss on anything here. So from Monday until Saturday, so not even a week. All I say is try it. You know, you you just by trying in in in, in, in getting started on e-commerce, you are already ahead of the other ninety nine percent. You already settled to do things differently. So if you work a nine to five, I just want you to know that there's there's a way out. I was doing valid parking and I was doing Uber after my my valid parking shift in order to make this to work. So there's a way out. There's You can definitely rely on your idea on starting on e-commerce to get out of your nine to five. It is possible. I'm here to tell you it is 100% possible. And um, this example right here, from April 30 to May 6, so exactly one week, I, I, one week ago, this past week, Today's Saturday, May 6th. So if this week, just waiting on Sunday to be a complete seven day week, we have $35,000. When I was working valet parking and when I was doing Uber at the same time, I'll probably, I'll probably have to wait or I'll probably have to work for, I'll say, I'll say just, I'll say more than two weeks. Uh, I'll say more than two years. I was making so little as a valid parking and I was making so little on Uber that if I want to make this 35000 with my two jobs, I'll probably have to work for more than two years. And the fact that we just did $35,000 in revenue this current week, is something that I don't take for granted. And that's the main reason why I'm sitting here recording this video for you. Because there's a way. And I was there. I was, I was exactly where you are. If you are if you're working nine to five, 
Many people shit on nine to five. I don't think nine to five is, is, a, is, is a bad thing. You need that stability. At the end of the day, we all need to pay the bills. So if you are working nine to five and you have that stability of having your bill paid, you that, that's just that, you know? That's just the stability that you need to grow as a human, you know, to grow as, uh, as a person just trying to be successful, you know? If you have a nine to five, you already have the stability. So it's what you do outside of your nine to five what is actually gonna determine how your life is gonna be. So if you are the type of person that spend the time that is not working on video games or nothing against video games, I sometimes play my my FIFA uh, now and then. But um, but it's because you know if I if I if I sit down and start playing FIFA. Uh, it's probably because I have worked my ass off and I already achieved the numbers that I want to achieve on a weekly basis. But if you're if you if you have your nine to five and you work in, you know, you're waking up every morning, you go to work, you do your thing, or every night you go, you do your thing, you know, you get your job your job done. I respect that. Then you get your time to sleep, you know, you get your time to rest. And then there's there's some time that you get in between. And that's the time where you actually build your 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 your, your life. So, you know, if you if you work in a nine to five, I respect you. You have a stability, you have a source of income so that way you can have your bill paid and you can also invest into your business that's awesome um, there's a way out so if you're watching this video you're probably thinking <clears throat> I need to get out of the 95 yeah I know 95 give me the stability but that's not what I want in life I actually want to be able to enjoy every single moment of my life the way that I want. And that's something that is tangible for everyone. There's no there's no difference between the people that enjoy their life fully and take advantage of every moment because they ha they get to decide what to do with every minute of their day. There's people that cannot enjoy that, cannot decide what to do every moment of their day and the difference between one person and the other is just what they do with their time. So if you are a nine to five, if you're working nine to five and you get to work and you, you get from home, you, you, you get to home from, from work and you just turn on Netflix and then, you know, just relax you you get a you get a long day so you try to relax you know you order some 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 chinese food and sometimes you know you can just you know smoke weed get get some video games you know i already i don't fish and work so i'll just relax right like i deserve it right and then the weekend come and you go out right because you deserve it that's what you think oh, i deserve it but when, when you when you say when you think you deserve something, when you are when you doubt yourself if you des deserve something or not, deep down means that you haven't earned it. So just the fact that you go out every week, every weekend, just to just because you deserve it, because you work all week, well guess what? Nothing is gonna happen. And you're gonna be 30, 40, 50 years old. And what would be the purpose? Like you're still gonna clock in, you're still gonna clock out still don't have control of the only life that you actually gonna have and you know having full control of your day-to-day -day is something that i feel is the most important thing in life besides stick to god and be connected to god on a daily basis that's obviously the most important and then after that i think it is to have the blessing or, or have the possibility of 
decide what to do in every moment of your day and have full control of your life. I think that's the most important thing. I think after talking with so many people and after getting into so many calls with so many people all these years, I think the most important thing about getting your own business is, the, is, 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 is to be able to have to get control back. So for you that are watching this video, I appreciate that you have been watching this long and I can tell you this next call that you're about to get is probably the most important call that you ever get in your life. And the reason why I say that is because if I get the chance back then when I first started on e-commerce to have the call that you are about to have and basically work one-on-one -on -one with someone that actually made it and can teach me the step-by-step -step process of how to make it without how to make it without necessarily having to make the beginner's mistakes and have to go through all that process that you have to go through when you are on your own. If I could have someone <clears throat> back then that I they could, they can give me that that guidance, my journey will be way easier and way less costly. So. I wish I could have the opportunity back then to have the opportunity that you now have uh, with this next call. This next, this this next call is gonna be is gonna determine the way that you are gonna finish this year. So we are still, you still have time to get into Exe. You still have time to start your Exe brand and monetize before all these drop cheapers, all these people that is on Shopify, Amazon. They tire about, you know, Amazon eating their their their, their, their profits, Amazon taking all the money. All those Amazon sellers, all those Shopify drop chippers are going to come into Exe by the end of this year, starting next year. So by that time, you already have established a business. You already have a brand. You already established on a platform that rewards you for being an established seller, for being an established business, and you don't have to worry about the competition. You won't have to worry about saturation. You won't have to worry about, you know, competition just 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 um taking money from your business because you're gonna be so stable, so into the exit platform that you only gonna have to worry about having your customers happy and you're going to be making money. So this next call is going to change your life. I mean that from the bottom of my heart because I know that we are putting into work. We are, we are making things happen on our end. We are bringing tangible results into our brands. Let me go over yesterday and today. So today, yesterday we did over 4,000 and Today, May 6, we have a total of $3,086. So just just for today, guys, yesterday we did over 4,000. Last seven days, we did 28,000. If, you, if we are counting May 7, which hasn't happened yet, so by tomorrow, Sunday, we're going to hit over $30,000 in sales for sure this week and then last 30 days over a hundred and forty thousand dollars and again this year so far from january 2023 until may 2023 not even the whole month just six days into the month and we already passed half million dollars in sales on xe one thing that I noticed about e-commerce, and not only from my experience, but I also have sit down with people that is really successful in the industry, and one thing that they all have in common, and I can include myself on that list, is the consistency, is the mindset, okay, is how to overcome problems. Because when you are an e-commerce business owner, it's not how these gurus on you know these platforms make it seem like. It's not as easy as people see it. And what I, what I mean about that is there's challenges that you have to face every single day. There's obstacles that you have to go over every single day and you have to be on top of the situation. It comes with, it rewards you because you make a lot of money. You can have the freedom that you really, really want. 
But in order to achieve that level of success or to achieve that freedom that you really want, you have to put in the work and you have to have the right mindset. It's the only way that you can get there. Otherwise, everybody will have a lot of money. Everyone will have the freedom they want. Why people don't have that is because of their mindset. So it's really important to have this the right mindset when it comes to working on e-commerce, when it comes to being your own boss. Because being your own boss is not necessarily what people make it seem. Being your own boss means that you need to be disciplined. Being your own boss means that you need to push yourself. And it means that you have to be out of your comfort zone in order to achieve results. Because you can be your own boss and you can fail if you don't have discipline, if you don't have that inner fire that you really need in order to make things happen. Yeah, you can have the right formula, you can have the right mentorship, but you need to have that fire inside of you. You need to be responsible for your own success. You need to be on top of every situation and understand that for the first, especially in the early stages of your e-commerce journey, you're here to overcome obstacles. Things are not going to be as easy as other people make it seem. You need, you really need to put in the work, you really need to be smart, and you really need to be a good decision maker. Because at the end of the day, that's what you are. When you are a business owner, when you own e-commerce businesses, you are a decision maker because you're going to have a team working for you. You're going to have people working on your business just like any other business. And your responsibility, it doesn't matter if you're 18 years old, if you're 28, if you're 36 you are the responsible of your success. You are the responsible of your business. So you are the decision maker. And if you don't have the right mindset, and if you don't know exactly what you're doing and how your business operate, then you are going to be a bad leader. You are not going to be a successful e-commerce leader with your team because you don't know the basics. So understanding how things work and putting into work is what is going to take you for an e-commerce. And that's what we're here for. We're here for to train you, we're here for to make sure that you have the right tools and that you are set up for success on e-commerce. That's what my thing can bring to you. That's what I can bring to you. The value of people that overcome all these obstacles, people that already went through war and they can come here and teach you exactly how to get a shortcut to the success that you want. I'm not a fan of shortcuts. I think that you should go through the process and learn from it, but it's really going to be less costly and it's going to be less hurtful if you do it with people that already went there and can get you the guidance that you actually need to succeed on e-commerce the right way, to make things the right way. One thing that I can promise you, I can put my name on it, is that if you are consistent, if you understand that consistency pay off on this game and consistency is the key of the game, is the secret of the game, once you understand that and you are willing to do whatever it takes to get your e-commerce business to the moon, that's when you already set yourself for success. It can take two months or it can take 12. But if you decide it, if you know inside that you're going to succeed, you are going to succeed. It is as simple as that. When I first get started, I went through everything. And when I say everything, everything from PayPal holds to people, you know, complaining about their order not getting on time, to losing money, basically, because I pay money to influencers and they don't bring me enough sales. There's so many things that you're going to go through when it comes to e-commerce and are necessary for you to pay the price. Because on the other side, I'm now the owner of a seven-figure brand. I live in a really, really nice building in Miami, probably the nicest, or at least that's my perspective. And I'm not saying this to brag or anything. I say this because I'm the same guy that five, six years ago was struggling. Thank God I got my family here in Miami and they, they support me and I didn't have to go through hell like other people. But 
uh, it was really hard. It was hard. It was hard. Living in a city like Miami and not making money is hard. Coming from another country is hard, you know? And so if I did it, you can too. There's no reason why you cannot. There's no reason besides not having the right mindset. The good thing is that by you booking the call with us and by us being the guidance of your e-commerce journey, you avoid these mistakes. You avoid having to go through war because we here to guide you in a way that you can overcome those obstacles along with people that already went through there through those obstacles it's just a matter of having common sense to understand that working with people that already went through that is going to make things way easier for you and it's going to make things way less costly Because you not only make mistakes when you're going to start an e-commerce, but you also lose a lot of money if you don't do things the right way. So working with people that already went through that and already lost that money, already make those mistakes, is going to help you because my team and I are not going to guide you in a way that you make the same mistakes. The way that we're going to do it is for you to actually get access to the back get access to the profits quickly faster safer risk risk free so that's what we're here for and that is actually the beauty of this i fail so i can now share that knowledge to you and you can avoid that and i'm 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 i'm, I'm understanding that now it wasn't clear to me back then i was thinking I'm a man of God. So I was asking God, why? Why if I have the right intentions? Why if I study this every day and every night? Why is not bringing me any results? And now I'm seeing the why. Now I'm in front of this camera and I can share my experience with my, my experience with literally everyone and I can teach literally everyone how to start from scratch and how to make a sustainable business how to build an e-commerce empire and i can do that just by sitting here and sharing all that knowledge to you so i'm grateful that i have to go through th all that process because it's now allowing me to share it with you and it's now allowing me to help you to overcome those obstacles that you have to go through because it's the it's the it's the it's the it's the price that we have to pay to get into e-commerce but I'm now here to help you and I also train really talented people that can help you as well so we here for that we here to make sure that your e-commerce journey can be easier can be less costly and you can enjoy the process you know that's the main thing Now, one thing that I want to clarify before we jump into the call is the fact that this is not a get rich tomorrow BS type of thing, okay? So if you have that mindset that, you know, we are going to get into this call and then we're going to build an Etsy brand or we're going to build a, any e-commerce brand and we're basically going to get rich within a week or you can be expecting to get results, you know, the next day or you're going to wake up probably three days from now and, and, and you're going to see like, one of your uh, posts with an influencer went viral and now you have $30,000 on your bank account. Hey, it can happen, right? It can happen. On e-commerce, you are exposed to that. You are exposed to the fact that an influencer can post something on the, in their TikTok account. It can go viral and it can bring you a lot of money. But just as it's something that can happen, it's also something that cannot happen. And it can take 30 days, 60 days, 90 days to get to that point. And that's totally fine. So if you are the type of person that is willing to put in the work, to put their head down and get to work before expecting to see multiple results, to see the same results that I get with this brand that I have been working for two years. If you have common sense and you are willing to do the work and you are willing to do whatever it takes to make it work, then this is for you.
if you are expecting to sit down and play on your PlayStation and hearing all these catching notifications within the first week, guess what? It's not gonna happen, bro. It's not gonna happen. Nowadays, I can sit down and I can play on my PS5 and I can get sales. I can make $2,000 by playing FIFA all day. Why? Because I earned that. I went through everything that I have to go in order to get to that position. And now that I'm in that position, the last thing that I want to do, bro, is to sit down and play FIFA. I want to make money online. I want to make money with my brands. And I want to teach serious people that want to scale their business fast and scalable and, and, and sustainable. I want to help them. That's why I'm recording this video. That's why I'm not playing FIFA. So you know deep down, if you have that right mindset, you're going to make it happen. So this is something that is going to take work on your end just as much as it's going to take work on our end. But I just want you to understand that it does take work in order to make money on e-commerce. Especially if you want to see those six, seven figure months. If you're expecting to do $2,000 per month and you are okay with that, then that's fine. You probably need less work. But I'm not here to make $2,000 per month. I'm here to make 20, 30, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100,000 dollars per month. And I'm not just saying that I'm doing 150,000 dollars per month and I'm not different than you. So if you're here just to make 2,000, 3,000 just because you you're prioritized playing FIFA or playing Call of Duty, then that's fine, bro. Good luck. But if you are here to make sustainable businesses that can bring you six figures per month and you already know that it's going to take work from you, it's going to take focus, it's going to take the, it's going to take for you to make the right decisions to get to that point, but you're willing to do all that and you're willing to do it with us that already went through that, then let's do it. Now, when I talk about six figures, seven figures months, I know many people here will say like, oh, man, that sounds like a little bit too much. Like this guy is probably dreaming. I'm not dreaming, bro. I can go right now into my stats and I can show you my own brand doing that. And if I can do it, you can do it. I'm not different than you at all. I probably have 10 times more disadvantages than you. My English is not even perfect, bro. You know, and I'm making seven figures with an Exit brand. You know what I mean? Like, you imagine what you can do. So I know this is going to sound crazy, but I want you to do this. I want you to close your eyes. And I want you to see the number 100,000. I want you to, I know, I know this is crazy. I know this is my, my sounds crazy to you. If you're, in, if you're in a coffee shop, people will probably look at you like, what is this guy or girl doing? It doesn't matter, okay? Just close your eyes and imagine a hundred thousand dollars on your bank account. It doesn't matter if you if you if you use Chase or if you use Capital One and if you use Bank of America, just imagine that dashboard with a with a hundred thousand dollars in it. Just imagine that. If you already have that on your bank, then okay, bro. I'm sorry, <laughs> but if you don't. Just just close your eyes and watch that number. And do that for at least 10 seconds. Just do me that favor, please. I did this. I did this so many times, and I promise you it works. Because if you start thinking this way, if you know, if you want to even go deeper, you can, instead of thinking about your, your, your bank account, you can think about your XE dashboard. Think about your XE dashboard. Like, if, if you haven't seen an XE dashboard before, if you don't have an XE, XE shop yet, just just Google it, right? And and get see an XE, an XE dashboard and imagine that you have a hundred thousand dollars in revenue, right there. Or even better, get uh, get get a screenshot that it says more than a hundred thousand dollars. You can use any of my screenshots. You can go to my Twitter right now and get any of my screenshots and just see it and imagine that number on your head. Close your eyes and see it because it's gonna create that mindset that we need in order to succeed. If you want to work with us, you need to have the right mindset. It's, 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 it's all about the mindset, bro. I promise you. That's why so little people make it in life because not everybody have the right mindset. We all so busy into everything that we have going on, like all the programming that we have on a daily basis. 
the news, uh, you know, the Twitter feeds with the bad news, uh, Facebook feeds, um, Instagram with academics just just throwing negative uh, posts on a daily basis, and we consuming all that, and we forgot about our goals because we are all so deep into the negative, the negativity that the media wants to promote just to grab our attention and we get lost in the sauce we sometimes will not even remember what what our purpose is so that's why it's so important for me to for you to like if your purpose if you're in this call it means that you really want to make money i know for sure that you want to make money because you book a call with us you're watching this video so it's really important for me to to to, to get you into that mindset i wake up every day and i just i just i just put numbers on my head i just you know, obviously, I, first thing I do is pray because if we don't pray, then none of this is going to happen. But once you pray and once you get that, you know, good energy in your body, it's time to it's time to recreate your reality before it happens. And the best way to do it is to close your eyes and see your goals and forget about the feeds on Instagram and all that BS. Just focus on what you really want to do, what you really want to accomplish on a daily basis. And never forget it. If you want to write it down next to your bed every night and every morning, your goals, you know, whatever your, your, the amount you need in your bank account for anything, you know. There, I, I talk to so many people on a daily basis. There's people that is doing e-commerce because they want to help their parents. They want to help their parents to retire because they understand that, just as we count on our parents to to grow up it is our duty to take care of them now and that's the beautiful purpose that's actually one of my purposes so i can you know i, I connect with people when they told me that, when they tell me that they're doing this for them their parents so whether if you do it for that reason or you do it for yourself or maybe you have a kid coming have a daughter coming remember that he's sick and he's needing help you know there's so many beautiful reasons like people always have a why and that's beautiful that's something that you need to have on your mind every day when you show up to these classes when you show up to these calls like the one that you're about to get with my team it's important to remember your why remember the reason why you are in that call remember the reason why you are watching this video remember the reason why you actually take action when you see what we're doing and it's because when you want you i can I don't I don't know every single person that is watching this video, but I can tell that it's because you want something to happen. You want something to change, and um, that's the that's the main goal. The main goal is to 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 have a goal, <laughs> literally, to have a purpose, to wake up every morning. And the best thing is that you already took that first step. You are already into something that is great. It's 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 it's, it's, it's the perfect time. Is the right time. It's 2023. XE is a platform that is not saturated. It's a platform that is literally there for you to make money. So this is the best opportunity for you to jump into this e-commerce platform. It's super new in terms of people discovering the platform. So learning from people that is already Building a success, a successful business in this platform is key for you in order to move forward and to get the right guidance. So let's get to work. Let's make it happen. Again, mindset is everything when it comes to these type of businesses. So I hope that you have an open mind when you get into our calls. That way we can help you better. That way we can understand where you want to go and see if we can help you to get there. I'm pretty sure if you have the right mindset and if you are willing to do whatever it takes to make it happen, we are going to be able to help you. So this next call is going to be really important for you. And I promise you it's 100% worth it. Whether if you decide to work with us or whether if you decide to go on your end, I wish that you stick to the plan that you trust the process because e-commerce is the best thing that can happen to us. Like we are really, really fortunate. We are probably in the best and the easiest time in history to make money. And I really want you to take advantage of that ditch of that, whether if you work with us, whether if you do it on your, on your own, I wish you the best. I really hope that you take action because this is the best time in history to make money, especially money online, how we like to call it Wi-Fi money. So guys, I'll see you inside of the program. I can't wait to work with you guys. 
and I wish you the best of luck. God bless you, and I will see you in the program. Anybody here? Peace.